Well, I said you'd see me again. My uh, my first video was apparently too long for YouTube, so got split it up into two parts. Uh, if you caught this one before the other one, just go watch the other one first. Is the way I, you know, ran them together. Uh, but YouTube cut me short, so I had to post them twice. Thanks for watching. And of course we've got the firearms. I'm not going to spend too much time here. This isn't all of the firearms we have. It's just what I could you know, readily grab. I may do some some shooting videos and some gun reviews. Um, some other gear reviews. I'm not sure yet. Uh, there's so much gun porn out there on the internet. You know, you really don't need need me adding more to it. I guess. So. But I may, you know, do some videos, talk about a few things. Uh, yeah. Some rope back there. Yeah, you know, that's things that people forget a lot. You know, everybody wants you know this stuff here. But you got to think about the things that that you want. You know, won't have. Probably never think about. You know, I mean, the guys in the movies always have rope, and they always end up using it. So, you know, get my stupid rope. <laughs> yeah, we're gonna go take a look at some, some chickens now. It's a fantastic source of fantastic source of both meat and eggs. Uh, the thing about chickens is they're not particularly expensive. To keep and raise, and the yield far, far outweighs the the expenses. Please, what are y'all missing? Where y'all at? Chicken just attacked me. Got one more in there. What is your problem, chicken? She's never done that before. Hmm. Huh. Starting to worry me a little. Pissed off chicken trying to hurt me here. So we got one over there. She's been breeding. Girl, and some eggs for us. But we uh, obviously we fabbed this up, built a framework, and threw an old truck cover on top of it. Built them some boxes. Works fine for them. They give us more than enough eggs. is our rooster. As you can see he is isolated. That's because he's a jerk. Aren't you? Yeah, you're a jerk. See? He's an ass. I'm not happy with uh, with acquiring him at all. Hmm. Try to round us up another one so we can get some some baby chickens out of it. That is our chickens. It's the only livestock that we have at the moment considered uh, getting a few other things some goats some, some pigs so uh, the people next door to us are they have a whole little farm over there so we trade out pretty good we have a good rapport built it's you know, pretty convenient so 
but I don't know. I'll probably get some of my own anyway. So, uh, so that's our chickens. We, uh, we have an abundance of wildlife in this particular area. Um, and uh, to try to keep the deer going where we want them to go, we put in these little feeders. If I can get a good shot of that. These are just four inch PVC pipes that we cut a hole in the bottom of. camouflage them up and you just fill it up with corn and it pretty well sorry about that it's, yeah, and that keeps uh, keeps anything from getting down in it and, uh, we got the trail camera set up on them so that's going to be a fantastic picture of me making this video We've got uh, quite a bit of woodlands on back to an uh, open water source. So as long as we, you know, they'll be on the property, but it's far easier on us if we steer them where we want them to go. Oh, you can see over that way. Over there, it's part of the neighbors. They got their goats and chickens and whatnot out there. So there's a horse. And we can go get a shot of the stuff right next door. Yeah, that's kind of fuzzy, but... That's just some of theirs. We have uh, quite a bit of acreage. So not only do we have livestock between the homesteads, but we've also got wild wildlife that we can harvest. <laughs> it's like I'm going to have to finish it up in three parts. Sorry guys, the first one was pretty long. I'll keep them in check from now on. Appreciate it.